Good evening and welcome to Girlfriend Minute. I am Char. And I'm Pascal. <laughs> I know we're like, I'm good. How are you? <laughs> you sure it's not spiked? No, <laughs> it's not. Okay, it's just not. checking. It's not. <laughs> I don't know. Let me see. No. <laughs> <laughs> right. No. Oh my gosh. I wish it was, but no. I think I'm too right. tired for that right now. <laughs> I am definitely tired. It is 12:24 a.m. It is. Gosh, how did we get here? I don't know. I weekend don't know. blink and it's gone. You know, it's it is. Gone. You know, time flew this weekend. Like yesterday, I was here. I opened and I was working on a couple of things, and then the next thing I knew, it was like five o'clock, and I'm like, "Holy cow! Like, where, where did the time go?" Yeah. It's yeah. same thing today. Same thing today. It yeah. was like nothing. One, two, three, all gone. And I'm like, oh, my yeah. God, crazy. Well, when I babysit, and I've been babysitting today, the day, it's it's continuous. So, yeah, it yeah. goes pretty quick. <laughs> sure does. Yeah, you know, it goes pretty quick. So, yeah. So, so how's was, the babies? Oh, they're good. They're yeah. good. Sweet as pie. Aziel's all better now. He's over his little bout of pneumonia. And, Very um, good. Little Miss Milani, she's sweet as can be. And oh, uh, I know. She's a cutie pie. I see her on Facebook when you yeah. post her. She's such a cutie pie. Yeah, she's she's just got these cute little eyes, and they're just <laughs> so adorable. She, you know, she looks like you. <laughs> no I yeah. swear to you she does I was looking at her the other day and I'm like she looks like her she looks like so, her grandma her Nona a lot of people, you know, a lot of people used to say about Aziel when he was younger too so I'm like oh don't tell my daughter <laughs> yeah <laughs> good grief <laughs> no but she does so. she resembles you a lot I I see it I can see it I had to uh, return something to Target today I bought a bathing suit and I didn't like the way it was cut so I returned it Mm -hmm. And so I had her today. And so I, you know, of course, I always go through the baby section because that's just sure. what I do. Mm -hmm. So, you know, yeah, how could you goes. not? I, know, last, <laughs> I always do, too. I, <laughs> last weekend, I did my big Costco run. And of course, you know, I'm buying pajamas and stuff for them at Costco sure. because they're, you know, it's like a three pack for 12 bucks. I'm like, well, okay, how can you beat that? You know? <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. They have such great deals at Costco. I know sometimes yeah. I, I go in there and I look at, you know, I could use sneakers for in here and I'm not a big sneaker fan. So yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. I try to get, you know, whatever deals that I can. And they have really good schedules. Sketchers and they're not that expensive and I like yeah. sketchers. So. I was looking at the Adidas. They had Adidas last weekend. Mm -hmm. I thought, oh, mm -hmm. maybe. But um, so you know, I bought them some things there and yeah. And yeah. And then of course during the week I was shopping, so I bought them a few more things. Of course, <laughs> of course. Well, it was Milo's birthday today and he turned uh. four. Uh. And so he had all his um little cousins actually around similar ages to them um uh they were all there and my daughter just uh her and her husband just had like a little gathering it was just you know his family um like mom and dad and sister and uh husband of sister and their kids and so on um and then us of course and uh, it was cute it was sweet it was a small gathering it wasn't large everybody could talk to each other and that's how you know it should be but right. you should you should have seen Oliver. You know, I bought him one of those um, little bumper car thingies, you know, that they're open, though, and they sit in it. Did you ever see them? Oh, I've seen them at Walmart. So I bought him one for Christmas last year. OK, <laughs> he was deathly afraid of that damn thing. He thought it was just going to come out and bite him in his butt. Yeah. Today, he proved me wrong. He can maneuver <laughs> that thing in that house. Yeah. Like like nobody's business. I never, never in my life. He doesn't even bump into the couch. He doesn't hit anything on the floor. He doesn't hit <laughs> your feet. He will literally maneuver it around everything. He can drive that thing. Yeah. Like I don't know how he does it. What's the age on that? I actually have never looked at one up close. I just figured Ozzy I think was too two, little. Two two and up. Oh, well, he'll be too soon. Yeah. June. He'll be yeah. too. Maybe I'll do that for him for his birthday. Walmart has a sale. It's always like ninety nine dollars or less. So yeah, I've seen yeah. him there, and I thought, oh, those are yeah. cool. I wish, wonder if I could fit in one. 
prom. My daughter can. <laughs> oh. Yeah, she Just rides it with him. <laughs> when you when you get here, we're all gonna have our own. <laughs> well, you know that I think they make some for adults. I think I ran into something, and they make some for adults. I'm like, we are all getting one, all of us. Do they? I think so. Yes, I will look it up and send it to oh, you because we are all yes. getting one. Oh, please! <laughs> How fun I'm would game. that be? <laughs> It'd be a lot of fun. I, I'll do any. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Zoom, zoom. <laughs> if I'm zooming, I'm happy. Yeah, yeah. No, definitely, definitely. That would be yeah. cool. It would that be, wouldn't it? Adult big wheels. Oh, my God. I know. I know you sent me the picture one time. I love it. I remember riding our big wheels when we were yeah. younger. Oh I loved my big wheel. I rode that thing until the wheels came off, man. Yes. <laughs> yeah. We had a, a red and yellow one. I Mine think. was red and yellow with some blue, yeah. Two, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I think they were all the same color at the same time. They were like the primary time. colors. Yeah, yeah, at that time, yeah. yeah. So. But, yeah, you know, they were fun, man. They oh. were they were a blast. Yep. We used to ride them down the hill and then kind of tip them over and fall in the grass. <laughs> I used to fun. spin out in mine in the side. Oh the yes, and it slid. flat spots in the yes. in the tires because they're plastic, you know. Yes, yes. I'm like, <laughs> yes. No, oh, it was yeah. Good day. A lot of hours. Good times. They were, they were definitely yeah. so. But yeah, yeah, so you know, so I had her today, so I um I still have her. She's sleeping in her room, and so mm -hmm. uh yeah, and then I went and got her a few outfits. Of course. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. It's okay. She's a girl. She's allowed yeah. to have a lot of outfits. She's a she's a young, dainty girl. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. So I also bought her a new sleeper, and I of course then I wash everything once I get it home. So yeah. she's wearing little lemons right now. <laughs> Aww. And her little feet, the little feet on them are lemons, uh, and it has little green leaves at the ankles yeah. <laughs> sticking out. <Aww. laughs> she moves. They move. <laughs> So cute. When my daughter gets here, she's going to be like, what's this? I'm like, they're lemons. Yes. <laughs> they're adorable. This was, um, I can try to show you the picture here. Milo and my Aww. daughter. There we go. Aww. And that's an, yeah. That's sweet. Aww. And that's olives with a He's little so curly cute. hair. He's yeah. got curly hair. Aww. Yeah. 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 That's a special chair for, um, kids um you know that are disabled uh mm -hmm. and he was absolutely comfortable in that that's for sure yeah um and then this was a, the picture of the whole family oh yeah yeah so they had a good time what a good looking family oh thank you they had a great time they had a great time. So blessed, you know, blessed on both sides. Everybody um, is there for them. So thank God for that. Oh, yeah. 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 That's. But that's uh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it was good, though. It was fun. It was fun. Oh, I saw um, Danny's um, girl turned, what, 21 today? She turned 21 today. Yes. Wow. That's so awesome. Yeah. I know I've never met her, but I feel like, you know. Since I got to know you guys, you know, pretty well um, last year, it's, uh, well, you, like, forever ago, but, you know, Danny and them, <laughs> like, yeah. you know, it's, it's, I don't know, you feel like you're part of, you know, their life, so. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it, it, it is. I, I love her kids. Um, mm -hmm. Raina and Caden, I, I do. I, they're, I like talking to them, so. Yeah. Um. And Raina's sweet, and um, yeah, I like their, I like her kids. So. Oh yeah. Yeah. But, no, uh, good. It's a good time. Everybody's having a birthday. April is like crazy for birthdays. Is it? Yes. I mean, my dishwasher here. It was her birthday, and then it was her um daughter's birthday and then it was my daughter's birthday and then my brother and then my grandson and then my cousin and I could just keep going on and on <laughs> but it was like a lot of people's birthdays June was has always been a busy month for my family so yeah. it's like 
I have a nephew and I have a niece and an in-law mm-hmm. and then my sis, my deceased sisters and then my birthday's the next day. Mm-hmm. And then I have another relative's birthday I have, and then there's an anniversary. So there is something and usually typically two things every week in the month of June. Okay. So June typically ends up being June busier is, for me. June is your month. Yeah. yeah very cool. So, but yeah, so I don't know. It's been a week and uh, I may start drinking. (laughs) (laughs) Well, Danny and I went and got our toes done. Did you? Last night. It's Friday night and then we have dinner, toes and dinner, petties and dinner. Yes. And we went to this place and um, she wanted Yaya's, so we were going to go to Yaya's, and then we ended up, I think it's Whiskey Joe's or something. I had wings. They were delicious. And They still um, have Yaya's? There's, like, two. Oh, and get we out. will travel for Yaya's. <laughs> I don't bl- I used to work at Yaya's. Oh, did, uh, did you? So there's one I on did. Roosevelt in St. Pete, and that's where we were. And now in the parking lot of Whiskey Joe's, she's like, oh, we could go there and be waited on. I'm like, well, let's go there and be waited on. So I had their wings, because she goes okay. to the one, apparently, over here in Largo, and I've never... I went to this one once before because I went to Yaya's and they were closed and I didn't know it. Mm-hmm. They were closed for a special event, which was not typical. They had a sign in the door. So I ended up over there because I was just starving. And um, so this was my second time there. She's like, they have good wings. So I had wings and they were delicious. So, so, so yeah. where's the other one? Is the other one still in um, oh by my Countryside God. Mall? On US oh, 19. that's no, it wasn't there. It was over by Publix and Indian Rocks Road. No, that one's gone. No, not Indian Rocks Road. You know, I used to, you know, um, oh God, I lost like, you know where I used to live? I used to live right there where the rec center is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. So if you went down, if you went down that street past the rec center and you go all the way down until until Indian Rocks Road. Is it Indian Rocks Road? It is. It is. Is it really? It's a Nona Church. Past the Nona? Yep. Past the Nona? It was Yaya's and then the Publix. Uh-huh. Okay, yes. So there was only that Yaya's? Yes. There's the one by Countryside Mall, because that one's still original. <laughs> it needs okay. to be revamped. The okay. one on Roosevelt's been revamped. And then there was the one on Park Boulevard that was also that Cedars restaurant. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So there's just... only two in the area. And um, so I hit it every probably once a month. I do. And That's I send good. her a picture and she's like, zip it. <laughs> it's a little bitter. What do you get but from there? What do you get? I get the go. traditional shredded chicken salad, the pita with the honey butter. And I'm a happy girl. I know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Looks like I used to make all that stuff. And I'm mm-hmm. like, oh, my God. The Yaya's was like the best thing ever. It was mm-hmm. simple. Plain yep. royal chicken. And delicious. Yep. With a gyro bread with the honey butter. Mm-hmm. And then you can make it into a gyro. salad. And gyro, exactly. You can make it into a Greeks salad. Because the Greeks correct me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is. Gyro. It's not and a like, gyro. They looked, like, they looked at me like, what? I'm like, what? <laughs> I know. <laughs> well, you know, you want to laugh because I sell gyros here or gyros, the way gyros. they say it. Gyros. Yeah. Um, I sell them here, so I sell the lamb and the chicken, right? So I get customers Yummy that ask me. Stuff. Yeah, so I get customers that ask me. They're like, well, how do you say it? I said, I don't know. I'm Lebanese. I'm not Greek. <laughs> <laughs> but I said, then I usually say, um, I say, no, I know. Like the Greeks say it, yiro. So that's yeah, exactly yiro. what it is. Yeah, yeah. that's why it's yeah. yaya. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's why it's yeah, 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 yeah. So it's no, yeah. I used to so, love that place. I loved we it. We decided, so you know, I had a drink and I wanted a rum and coke. Well, they have Pepsi products, so that's a no go because it's not coke. And I'm sorry. No, yeah. No, 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 can't do it. No, I don't care if you put rum in the Pepsi. It's still Pepsi, and I can still <laughs> taste it, and I don't like it. <laughs> I just can't do it. I agree. So, I agree. I I'm a ju- coke person. Yeah, I had a ginger ale and rum. So. Yeah. That's yeah, I'm totally doable. a Coke person, so I understand. Yeah. I understand how that goes. Yeah. But yeah, I could drink so. a a cherry Pepsi. A cherry Pepsi is very close. It's close to a Coke if you add lemon. Nope. 
Yeah, but you have to, you have to like. <laughs> well, I don't drink lemon. cherry Coke. I don't drink any of the funky flavors. If I'm having a Coke, there's rum in it, and that's it. I, other than that, I don't drink soda. <laughs> right. So, I mean, it's a very fine line for me. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. Yeah. yeah. So I, well, I don't I'm a big, do I'm an avid water that. drinker, but when I do have a Coke or something, I love to put a lemon in it. It just gives it that zing. So. Yeah. I love yeah, it. So. Yeah. They're like, do you want a lime in your? I'm like, I don't want no fruit with my rum and coke. No, <laughs> no, not with a rum and coke. I like, I was just have a lime on it. I'm like, well, we'll take a picture, but then we're done with the lime. <laughs> yeah, no, no, that's you put the lime in the coconut and shake yeah. it all up. <laughs> right. That's where so, the lime but... belongs. <laughs> yeah. Right. So yeah. So that's yeah. that was last night. So. Okay, well, not too, too what much do we going have on. this week? What did you um, well, ask I these lovely light people? Well, easy because, you know, us girls, we talk about all kinds of things. So I asked, what do you notice first, a person's eyes or their smiles? And I'm pretty sure we touched base on this just in general conversation a long time ago. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, so what do you notice first? Um, Their smile. Yeah. Yeah, I noticed the smile. I think um, the smile will, for me anyway, the smile brings out the eyes. And then I notice the eyes after that. For me, it's the smile reaches the eyes. It's kind of yeah. a combo for me. And yeah. so, yeah. So um, a lot of people, uh, you know, the first response obviously is eyes. The second response was teeth. <laughs> teeth, yes. Well, that's very and important. Your teeth, you may not need to be smiling. <laughs> um, you don't want to look like a crack whore. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, know, right? And if their teeth are really bad, they probably were. So you are. <laughs> exactly. I had yeah. a guy friend tell me who, who actually was a big druggie. He's like, the first thing to go is their teeth. So now I'm always oh, looking yeah, at people's of teeth. So for me, it's the smile and it reaches the eyes. It all kind of goes together. Uh, someone said teeth can be an absolute deal breaker. That and what comes out of their mouth. Hopefully, it's not their teeth. <laughs> oh my God, is that a girl? Yeah, <laughs> she's hilarious. I love that. I hope it's not their teeth. <laughs> right. <laughs> Made me laugh. <laughs> uh, I, I mean, it happens. <laughs> It does it happen. Happens, yeah. Um, it happens. <laughs> That's a good one. I like it. Unless they have particularly um, <laughs> noticeable smile, good or bad, it's their eyes. So, good or bad, yeah. Um, their smile. My mom always told me I needed to smile more. Maybe that's why. Well, were you frumpy, Crystal? <laughs> Did your mom think you need to smile more? That's Crystal. <laughs> That's Crystal. All right, Crystal. <laughs> she smiles a lot now, so maybe she does. I don't. Know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I mean, I I don't remember her not smiling like in the, now anyway. But yeah, I gotta say, smile. Although that doesn't always mean how good of a person they are. No, well, no, it doesn't. No. It definitely doesn't mean that they're necessarily a good person. So I I did Google. Um, before we continue reading a few more answers and, it, um, it's women said it was smile over eyes, hair, and body. Okay. Okay. You didn't say how many women said out of what percentages or anything like that. And it mm-hmm. says, according to the survey by the American Dental Association, <laughs> wow, me up that there was a survey, but there <laughs> was people. Yeah, rank a smile as the most attractive physical feature in others. Women also say it's the first thing they notice. Yeah, I mean, it's true because it's... Well, I mean, it is, but... Yeah, because you're looking at like a person's they face. have this genuine smile, their eyes light up. Glow, just right? Kinda, yeah, kind of glow, and it goes together, yeah. and I notice them both kind of at the same time for me. Yes. You know, so yeah, the, yeah. the smile catches me first, but then when they do do it and it's, it comes more organically um, mm-hmm. and it has, it's a nice smile, then the, the, the eyes will then light up and then my eyes will then go to their eyes because, yeah, you know, automatically. So I had a friend write teeth and smile and I laughed and I said, then eyes, because she has the thing about eyes. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay. If one eye strays. <laughs> she's done. <laughs> she's done. <laughs> <laughs> so every now and then I send her like a a picture of like a guy with his eyes crossed. <laughs> oh my gosh, she probably and she's like out. that, and if their thumbs are weird, but that's all. <laughs> oh God, yes, yeah, that's another story. <laughs> yeah, that's another story. Another story there. <laughs> Yeah, so oh I was God. like, I, uh, I, you gotta send her the ones that twirl like this. I have, <laughs> have you? Yeah, yeah, I've done a few things over the years. Oh my God, that's hilarious. No, that's yeah. funny. Yeah, yeah that's so, funny. yeah, if one eye just goes in just a little, she's like, oh. <laughs> I don't blame her because what the heck are you looking at? <laughs> where, is, where is it going <laughs> and I mean you know yes I make light of it I mean nothing if somebody has a problem you know we're not yeah. thing we're not laughing at those people like that so don't take it the wrong way people okay calm down <laughs> this is very light <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but in her job sometimes when she had to interview people anyways we won't go there but <laughs> yes <laughs> When she worked, yeah, she's retired now. So, um, smile, then posture, and then hands. Hands, okay. Mm. What's the whole thumb thing? <laughs> it, I guess, yeah. Because, well, to me, it would be cleanliness, I think. The fingernails. Well, nails, yeah. Yes. And fingernails. you know what creeps me out? I'm sorry, I have to say this. I cannot stand a man with long nails. If your nails mm -hmm. are as long as mine or longer, my skin crawls and that's you need to know <laughs> oh my god that creeps me out too like it's, why are your nails long to begin with what are you like uh, what are you doing with them <laughs> I, I, you know, I just can't yeah. just I can't I can't yeah. I have a friend and he had a thumbnail long I'm like yeah you you need to trim that <laughs> he's mm -hmm. looked at me I'm like that's a no <laughs> yeah <laughs> No, I don't. I don't blame you. That's that's I, something crazy. That's yeah, crazy. It's just I I don't know. I just I don't think certain things belong on men. I'm sorry, and that would be long nails. Yes, long nails are a no no on men. I mean, there's no Among need other for things them. with nails, but just just they don't need to be long. Let's just just seems creepy and dirty to me. So we'll yes. just no thank <laughs> you. No thank you on nails. Uh, and then someone posted their aurora. Their aura, you mean? Not aurora? Aurora. Aurora. <laughs> aurora. Aurora. <laughs> this is when your eyes hurt and you're tired. Yes. <laughs> it's been a long week. <laughs> yeah, they're writing aura in the does. dark. <laughs> yes. Yes. Because <laughs> the baby was asleep. I was writing in the in the yeah. light of the TV, <laughs> trying mm -hmm. to. <laughs> Yeah, I know, no, you know, a person's aura, yeah, yeah. I mean, but I don't but think I catch kind of that comes... at the beginning, though. I don't no, think I catch it, I like, just, right I, at the um, beginning. No, I think that, like, again, it's the smile and the eyes. and. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I, I agree. I don't know if they're, if they just, it's just sincere. I don't know. You just can tell. Yes. Yes. You do. You can tell exactly the way the way somebody will look at you when they're smiling at you. Either you, either they're um, they're sincere, like you said, or they are a villain. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what other word to use, and I don't want to use. I didn't want to say something terrible, so we'll go with villain. <laughs> I know what you mean. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, because it's goes with the you, long nails for me. But anyways, <laughs> well, you know, like um, there's certain people when you're looking at them for me, like even though something is coming out of their mouth, that's nice or they're smiling nice at you. But you can tell in their eyes like there's something else going on in their head. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. You know, like they're not really sincere. They're just yeah. doing it just. To I do mean, it. They smile, you're going to see their teeth. So it's Correct. kind of the whole thing for me. Correct. So someone said, uh, smile first. And then someone else said, smile. When a woman smiles, it can light up the world. True. True. I agree. <laughs> I agree. We are women so, and we do smile lovely, don't we? <laughs> we do. 
uh, lighting up the world, I laugh. I can't help it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> a bit much. <laughs> well, sorry. <laughs> I am tired. Not a youngin. Not a youngin. No. Older, older person, or not a youngin. Uh, that wrote that. Yeah. Um, he is. I know he's in his forties. Okay. Okay. He must be um, in love. Poor thing. No. No. <laughs> Um, <laughs> no. no, no, I don't, I don't know how to say this without anyone being like, oh my God, I, you know, oh, here's the problem offended. with talking, people get offended. So it, they're just the words. It's not, I'm not picking. He's a nice guy. Yeah. Uh, you know, we get along, we're friends because mm-hmm. we work together. Mm-hmm. Um, In my opinion, uh huh, he is on the spectrum. Okay. And I'm not saying that because of this comment. I am saying that for many other reasons and dealings. So, um, yeah. So he's a nice guy. Okay. All right. But um, I am pretty sure he is on the spectrum, and there's nothing wrong with that. He pays his no. bills. He holds down a job. Yes. You know, it's yeah, he just I think he found the word that is just simply sweet, you know, mm-hmm. just a simple sweet word that he used, you know, light up the world. I like it. I mean, it's kind of like imaginative, you know. Yes. Yeah. Yes, it is. So, yeah. Um, yeah so. Um... Yeah, it's good. It's OK. It's a good word. Yeah, so That's I wasn't trying word. to be mean or anything. I'm just saying. No, it's nothing I, to I, be I mean. know where you know this from. person. Yeah, know you know this person. person. Yeah, so yeah. it's not like you're saying it just for the hell of it, so. No, yeah. no, no. He's a good egg, so. Yes. He's good. Yeah, yeah we're, and so. we're not here to be mean, so. No, no. Please well. don't, don't be <laughs> just, well, in certain situations, yeah. I'm Sometimes not saying, we are. <laughs> Sometimes we are, but you know what, though? It's well, okay. Well, it's not really that we're being mean. It's more like we're just being really, really honest. honest. Thank you. And, and truthful. some people don't appreciate it. It's too bad for them. Go ahead. Next. You know. <laughs> um, neither their teeth. The, yeah, the, the teeth is a thing for me, too. It seems like a teeth is but a big goes, thing for everybody. Well, when you smile and if their teeth don't look clean, I mean. This is, <laughs> well, no, of course. Yeah, I mean, that kind of, you know, is like, OK, that's the. And then the first th- thought in your head is like, do you brush your teeth? Do you go to the dentist? Do you blah, blah, blah? Do you, you know, because now you're not focusing on their smile anymore. Now you're focusing on their teeth and what's wrong with that? <laughs> Well, you know, so again, my friend, he's kind of related through marriages. Mm -hmm. My cousin married his brother and we share, they're his niece and nephew, but they're my cousins. Okay. So we share these, these kids in common. Um, you know, he just says, you know, the teeth will tell you a lot about (laughs) about someone's habits. So for me, well, it's the very teeth important. And the smile and the eyes and being sincere and organic and how they take care of themselves and just overall, I I don't, you know, so yeah, you know, that stuff is attractive. Of course, of course, it is attractive. It's naturally attractive, along with sense of humor and how naturally smart they are. Yes, so those that are the will things. come after, but those are the first visual things that you're going to see in somebody visual, when you first meet yeah, them. Correct. Yeah. So like the one yeah. girl said who made us laugh, hopefully their teeth aren't coming out, but what comes out of their mouth, what they're saying when they're right. meeting you or meeting you. Yeah. Correct. is a big thing too. So yeah. they can have a great smile and stuff. And then the words come out and you just be like, Ooh, what happened? <laughs> you know? Exactly. Like, it's like, <laughs> Oh my God, you just became so unattractive right now. <laughs> like, right. And someone asked, is their booty an option? Of course the booty is always an option. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good squeezing tool, Dad. <laughs> Just saying. Yes. 
<laughs> oh, I love a nice booty. Nothing wrong with a nice booty. You know, I mean, I was not, I was not gifted with a nice booty, unfortunately. You know, that's family thing. Um, yeah, traits and what have you. However, I do enjoy a nice, you know, a nice booty every now and then. So, my ex boyfriend had a really nice booty. You know what, I, as I've gotten older, back to the whole smile in the eyes, lighting up in the teeth thing and all that is how they put themselves together. So if they look clean and they just, their clothes look clean. I mean, mm-hmm. cause I'm a t-shirt flip flop girl, but, mm-hmm. you know, but they're clean t-shirts minutes, and flip flops. Correct. <laughs> yes. They're not just like yeah. raggedy, raggedy and, you know, walking around everywhere. No. It's still no, clean so. and presentable. So, yes, but my, so. my boyfriend, I'm not my boyfriend, my ex-boyfriend. <laughs> he, I don't have a boyfriend. <laughs> not so right we'll, now. We'll go back to that in a minute. <laughs> yes. So he, the first time I met him is, is I let, uh, what attracted me to him was his smile. Um, I didn't look at his teeth because he didn't show his teeth when he was smiling at the time. It was just one of those, like, I'm looking at you kind of thing. I'm smirking, you know, that kind of, yeah. that kind of look. So later on when, um, uh, we got together and everything and I did see his teeth. So he has on his teeth, some discoloration. Mm-hmm. And so I was wondering like, what? Why does he have this discoloration on his seat? Like, what's what's going on? And I'm like, oh, God, maybe he doesn't take care of himself and yeah. everything. But he really does. He's really he was really put together and everything like that. And and he you know, he's gone to the dentist and everything. And the guy, the dentist has told him that the discoloration comes from uh, having a lot of protein that he had when he was a child. So, <clears throat> and that's where that discoloration comes from. Yeah. So there's certain things that cause. Yes. You know. Yeah. So it wasn't and that his I, teeth were bad. It wasn't that he yeah. was doing drugs. <laughs> no, <laughs> it right? wasn't that any, that he wasn't brushing his teeth or taking care of his teeth. It was just. My goal is from that. always to keep my teeth as wide as possible naturally. Yes. You know, that's always my goal. So, um, you know, when the teeth start to get dingy and stuff, I'm like, why? You know, right. um, I do. I, I work hard. I, I, I use like two different toothpastes. Yeah. I why not? It's the morning one and the, and the nighttime one is for the gums. So I alternate and my dentist is like, are you use? I'm like, I tell him, okay, you're fine. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. alternate. He does too. So yeah. I, I don't stick with the same toothpaste. I use different toothpaste every mm-hmm. morning and that night it's the same one so I'm really funny about my teeth and maybe yeah. because I had such bad teeth in school because I had teeth that were sideways my mom couldn't afford braces I did all this work myself to make them straight so right I I work hard to keep them happy and healthy and I have people I have friends that are like you have good teeth I'm like oh thank you <laughs> thanks Yes, I work hard at that. Thank you very much. <laughs> and it's funny to me because they notice. Yeah, well, they, I mean, you do. You have really nice teeth, and and um, well, thank you. <laughs> when I was, you're welcome. And when I was little too, my mom, my mom and dad, we never really went to the dentist either. So no, um, no. I actually use charcoal every now and then do to keep you. them nice and white. I use a little bit of charcoal. Oh. I use Tom's whole care with fluoride. I oh, do I've use seen fluoride that. because yeah. people, and then you can buy Tom's without fluoride. People are like, oh, don't use fluoride. Well, let me tell you something. Uh, whether or not you have cavities or not has nothing to do with how you care for your teeth. It's actually in your saliva and it's hereditary. Exactly. Yeah. And so I had big cavities when I was little, a few big cavities. Mm-hmm. And then I had them, they seemed to plague me in the teens too, a few. Okay. Um, so I, I use fluoride to keep the teeth strong and to help control that. I have not had a cavity in many, many years. And as a matter of fact, I had my first crown almost two years ago because a cavity from when I was little, that was so big, the tooth finally, cracked and I lost, lost the filling. Oh, there was not okay. much tooth left. It was an old lead filling from yeah, okay. when I was back the way I mean, back when, way yeah. back, way back, like yes. 11, 12. And they're like, wow, it held on that long. That's impressive. So mm-hmm. 
the crown I have is because of filling from way back when, but I haven't had cavities in years. Oh, and, good. Um, I work really hard at that because it's in the saliva. So I use a Tom's Whole Care. I also use my dentist. He loves Arm & Hammer whitening. It's oh, cheap. okay. And it does a good job at maintaining the whiteness of your teeth naturally without being overly abrasive. And then at night, I use a Crest Gum Detoxify. Okay. So, um, because I had some recession of the gums in the front because I have thin gums. Mm-hmm. And I had braces later in life. The combination don't always go well together. So, I actually had a skin graft done a couple years ago. Okay. So, I go to the dentist three to four times a year for cleanings to maintain because of the gum recession that I had sure. from having thin gums in the front and stuff and having that skin graft. Not only did I have to have a skin graft, I had to go back and have them move it up. So I had to have it twice. <laughs> essentially. Oh, yeah. And so I go to the dentist and it, it keeps everything happy, happy. So two visits are free and I pay for, depending on how the every three to four months falls, depends on how many I'm paying for. So Oh, okay. You know. Okay. Yeah. I'll be paying for two this year. It'll be four cleanings this year, but I do go to the dentist that often because of what had happened that was mm-hmm. under my control. So uh, they recommend I come three times a year and it sometimes is four. So, okay. Varies, well, that's but, good. Yeah. 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 So as long as your you teeth keep, are keep them healthy. It's a, yes. It's an attractive feature. So when someone smiles at you and it's sincere, they, and they, I don't know, it's just I don't know, just it is, for yeah, me, so. it is. Well, plus you, know, you want to keep it, them healthy. I, you don't want to lose your teeth later when you know you get much older. So no, it's like, no. no. Your teeth I'm are trying to keep my so own white teeth for so long. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know someone whose teeth, and I don't know why. If he just mm-hmm. has bad genetics and stuff, they're all just like nubby and rotted and oh, dark. No. And when he smiles, it, I can't. It, I can't look and he's a yeah. nice guy and stuff and he's got a wife and, and he I can't fix them. Wonders. He doesn't want to go and fix them. I, I don't ask because I feel like it's crossing it's, the line. Uh, oh, it, yeah. He started talking about, you know, my teeth are like this because of this or, that or whatnot. Then we'd have a conversation. Oh, okay. But if that door's not open for me. I don't ever feel comfortable. I don't blame you. I don't feel comfortable sometimes opening those kinds of doors either, you know, and be like, oh, my God, like so and so you really need to go take a shower. But I'm like, ah, but and then I'm like, it's not my business. I can't I can't overstep that. So I'm like, no, whatever, because then I don't want to look like an asshole. I don't want to look like a person be like, oh, my God, she's such a bitch. Look at her. You're like, oh. Yeah. Well, and, um, you know, my daughter was messaging me because she worked away tonight. So she's on her way. But um, so, yeah, um, I don't know. I think it's an attractive, an attractive feature. feature. Um, yeah. Uh, you know. Um, Definitely. Like, like, it's the first thing you see. Smile. And I like when it reaches their eyes I had some this past year hug me and the smile it, it reached their eyes it was sincere and I was just like I don't know I, I yeah. It, was, yeah it was attractive you know it was an attractive thing yeah and, my ex-boyfriend um, so. had that too it's like when you're looking at him and he's smiling at you you could just tell his eyes are just they're like uh I don't want to say love but they are very kind yeah. You know, it's just very kind and, and natural and organic the way he's doing it. You know, like it's just you look, it makes you melt. You know, it used to make me melt. Not anymore, but I don't care anymore. But it used to make you melt. <laughs> You're so funny. It, the smile reaching the eyes, it, you yes. know, just because they were hugging me and looking at me, it, it just makes you feel good. It makes it feel real and sincere and special. And because you don't get that from everybody and it's a rarity. Yeah. And, um, yeah. And you yeah. know, when somebody so. is actually sincere, you know, and like you said, yeah. it's not everyone. So it it is not everyone nowadays. Um, yeah. Be more kind to people. Talk. <laughs> sometimes they talk a good talk in, but their actions speak loud and clear. Um, yes. You know, it's and it's a shame. 
Mm -hmm. uh, if I'm anything, if you want to know anything about me, you may ask me, I will tell you the truth. You may not like it. <laughs> Maybe you won't care. I don't know. Well, yeah, I don't true. really have anything to hide. I, um, you know, it's, I just don't care, you know? Yeah. Um, yeah. Not doing anything spectacular, you know, not making meth in the bathtub. So I've got no yeah. secrets. <laughs> Are you sure about that? <laughs> I've heard, sure. I've uh, heard a couple things. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> right. I actually had a neighbor on the street. Oh, yeah, that was a whole scenario. And, oh, get out of here. <laughs> well, she was doing, yeah, she wasn't, and her teeth, when she smiled, I was like, oh. <laughs> You can, you know, like, yeah, yeah. back up. Yeah. But then, Carol, she's, you know, in the middle of the day, up the mailbox in her nightgown, the mailman's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. And I, I always wonder what happened to her kids. She passed away. I actually, um, her kids yeah. watched as she OD'd. Um, oh, that's great. As they were doing chest compressions on her on the stretcher, taking her out of the house. Oh, no. How old were they at the yeah. time? Well, the daughter was in elementary school with my daughter. Oh, no. Like fourth, fifth grade. And then she, the daughter, the half brother, who was a teen. And what was sad about that is they had separate fathers, though, because the mother passed, they were going to be separated, but they had grown up together. Oh, no. So it was, it was, that is sad. Sad it situation. It's a sad situation. But when I saw her teeth, and then I realized all her stories were just BS and, you know, you yeah. can tell. Yeah. 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 So, um, you know, it's important to take care of yourselves and men who want to attract women. It is. It is. Or real yeah. relationship. And well, it's just the way road again, as always, but it's, but it's called girlfriend. Minutes. <laughs> it is. Yes. Exactly. I keep it like this week. I've had a, a, a busy, crazy week. Um, with things thrown at me that um, weren't supposed to be thrown at me. And uh, so I just kind of want to make it fun. Brain. <laughs> yeah, and no, just, but this is a fun topic. People thought about people, you know, when you look at them, do they, as we get older, are we all looking at them the same way? Are you noticing the smile and the eyes? Or is it strictly are some still and then list that? Well, don't get me wrong, there's nothing wrong with us, but I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, as we age, what are you looking at? For me, I know it's definitely not, oh, he's cute. I wouldn't mind dating him. That was way back that was, then. Now yeah. it's like, I need to hear what comes out of your mouth. Do you take care of yourself? Are you naturally smart and funny? Not like I'm a know it all because I read it in a book that's yeah. not attractive and so yeah sure um you know yeah different things just... become more important to you as you mature like some of the things that you used to look at when you were in your 20s is way different than the way you look at it now so um definitely. but you know a nice put together person definitely is very attractive so definitely and there's a lot to be said for a nice smile and Yes, your and eyes. A genuine person, yeah. A genuine person, yeah. There's something yeah. to be said for that. So that was just kind of my lighthearted um Well, that was for fun though. I enjoyed it. You know, because I know the women, you know, all of us at work, we talk about different things all all over the place. And um, you know. Uh, my one coworker, it's like, not does he take care of himself, but she's like, I work two jobs. I'm from a different country. I bought my own condo. He's got to have something to offer. Absolutely. I'm going to let him in my house with the condo I bought on my own. No. And I don't blame her. <laughs> no, I don't blame her <laughs> either. That's right. Time. So it's yeah, you got to bring something to the table. Yeah, she'll be 60 soon. And it's mm -hmm. just interesting to hear the different perspectives because I sit there and I think, you know, back in the day, it's like, oh, he's cute. I date him. Now it's like, oh, he talked. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> We're done. <laughs> yeah. Now, now, it's now the like, way to my are heart. Are you intelligent? The way to my you, heart. You know? Yeah. Bring me yeah. a Malinois puppy. <laughs> <laughs> just shut right. with a puppy. <laughs> Now that's it. The end. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> the end. 
You got me at walking in through the door. <laughs> With a puppy. With a puppy. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> kind of. Yeah, well, I mean, it seemed like all the comments, you know, we all kind of, uh, all of us uh, look they at the just, same things, mainly, mainly you know, teeth. It's, it's you know? the teeth. And, and mm-hmm. yeah, it's, and it was very interesting that the American Dental Association <laughs> did a study. <laughs> It is, isn't it? And 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 as a kid, I would have never thought. I don't know, yeah. younger. You know, this just shows you mature, you change, you realize what's important, what becomes important in a relationship in life Definitely. and people. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it just uh, yeah. So you mature, you was, grow up, you you look at different things, you know, as you get older. So, but that was fun. I enjoyed it. I liked it. Thank you for all the comments, especially the yes, one about and, uh, the something coming, you know, out of there or their teeth coming out of their mouth. That one was hilarious. <laughs> I like that one. So, yeah, I'm still getting comments from last week's question. Yeah. That's still populating conversation. So. You know, um, are you really? It's funny how, yeah, it's funny how certain questions keep going for a few weeks, where others just you get some and then it just kind of it just kind of die down. So it was, you know, this obviously didn't have huge amount of response, but it had responses, and um, I was just kind of curious. I wish I should have asked too if you are female, what what's your age? Oh your yes, response. yeah, you know, because like I'm curious how old the booty person was. Correct. Now, some people don't want a real relationship or just looking for know, fun. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, I, it makes me wonder who, who, uh, yeah. So yeah. anyways, yeah, that's true. I'm always curious. So, yeah. So, you know, it was just kind of a lighthearted, uh, question. Yeah, to no, I liked it this week. A rough, it's great. Brutal, I mean, freak. yeah, exactly. Something to kind of like, just, it's, you don't have to think too much about it My when you're talking much, about it. So. I mean, it yeah. physically kind of hurts here. And I did take two leave a few yeah. hours ago and it's done nothing. So <laughs> yeah. here well, I am. Well, hopefully you can get a good night's sleep tonight and have a better day tomorrow. God willing. Uh, so. uh, yeah, I'm running away tomorrow. Um, are so you? you I want to run I away am. too. Where are you going? Where are you I, running I, away? Uh, On the I may, water? I may, I may run to you. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm open. So anytime. <laughs> I am actually super excited. Um, I booked a cruise for the week of my birthday in June. Very cool. I have um, kind of taken charge of some things and I've kind of have said some things and I'm like, I can always find someone to cruise with me. So um, I'm going on a cruise. I'm going for a week. I am super excited. On my birthday, I am holding a sloth and I am ziplining in Rotan. Rotan? You're going to hold a sloth? I'm going to hold a sloth. <laughs> I've always I wanted to hold a sloth. A sloth. <laughs> Oh my God. I don't know why I love those animals. I don't know why I like them, but I've always wanted to hold a sloth. Know. They're kind I don't of weird know looking and just so sweet. They strange. are. I don't know. Something about them. I don't know. But yeah. So um, for me, I'm they're calming. Um, they're calming. Uh, we're going to find out. Uh, so I'm going to Cozumel. And in Cozumel, I am snorkeling a reef and having a Mexican style lunch on the beach. Ooh. And then the next day I'm going to Roatan and I'm going to zip line and hold a sloth and see some monkeys and something else. And then the next day I am, what am I doing the next day? I don't remember. Isn't that terrible? Oh, I think I am snorkeling with, um, <laughs> don't I think say I sharks. am snorkeling. Is it sharks and rays? Oh, you stop that right now. <laughs> oh my god. In Belize. I'm going to Belize. Third stop is Belize, and I'm going to Shark Ray Alley. How fun. Uh, how fun though. I'm very you got excited. a great Yeah, you got a great week planned for that. And then the final um, excursion. I'm hiking ruins, so I'm very excited. Very cool. Very cool. A little bit of history, a little bit of water, yeah. A little bit of animals. 
it's going to be a lot mm-hmm. of fun. Yeah, I'm excited for so you. I've been wanting to go for several years and I kind of just was like, well, okay, I have no takers. So I'm going to put my foot down and say some things and what will be, will be. And um, so anyways, I'm going for a week because I need a break from life. And Absolutely. Here. And I need to go put my face in the water with a snorkel and some critters. So that's what I'm going to go do. And so I'm really excited. So well, yeah, it it, it'll be here before you know it. From Saturday to Saturday, the 22nd to the 29th. And um, yeah, I cannot stand myself right now. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh my yeah, God. I'm so, excited for you. You got to send me lots of pictures. I'm going to be doing pictures. I'm going to take my GoPro. I have a GoPro so I can take oh, it good. in the water with me. I typically take it, take it scalloping with me and stuff. So I don't have too much there, but I am taking that sucker. Um, I, everywhere. I'm ziplined before. So I'm trying to figure out if I want to get the harness to mount it on me for ziplining. Uh, okay. <laughs> but, um, or if they're going to have the helmets with the mount, then I can just mount my own. Ah, uh, okay. GoPro. There you go. I don't know, but um, I'm gonna take my own snorkeling gear because you know it's like pay to rent it while I own it. So and it's just a couple years old. I bought new snorkeling gear for myself, so I'm gonna take my own gear and uh, cause I don't know who's mouth, and I know they sanitize it in the well, sanitization. Yeah, I know. I'm taking my own gear. So, oh my know. god, when I went to um, when I went to uh, oh my god, what is that place? My daughter and I went to it. I can't believe it came. Um, Thailand when I went to Thailand so we went snorkeling off of one of the boats and that is all I could think of is whose effing mouth was on this piece while I was doing that mind so, you I had never gone snorkeling in my life that was the first time no. that was the first time I've ever yeah. gone snorkeling so, I started snorkeling right, uh, right when I shortly after I turned 10 And uh, I absolutely love snorkeling. And then I got certified and Patty certified for scuba diving at age 11. And um, so I went to Bonaire. And Bonaire is a dive capital, believe it or Mm -hmm. not. So if, I mean, you can snorkel Mm -hmm. there. Um, Wherever you see a painted rock with the name as a spot, you can go in the water and see something. So um, I had family that owned a condo and a warehouse and boat and had vehicles shipped down there and all that stuff and so I got to go there and um best nine day vacation because cell phones don't work there well they didn't back then and you know uh we had requested a phone line for the condo and we were given assigned a number but it was like three years before they actually ran the line (laughs) (laughs) because it's definitely island time everyone goes to lunch for like two hours and takes a nap the grocery store everything closes Oh, get out. <laughs> where where is this again? I need to go over there. Bon Air. Yeah, it's I'm bon going. Air. So, yeah, yeah. you know, it's the ABC Islands. It's Aruba, Bon Air, Curacao. It's off of Venezuela. Okay. Yeah. So, um, yeah. It, it was probably one of the best vacations I had because talk about being unplugged from everything. Oh, I love I mean, I was in the water that. every day. I was, I was diving every day. I was down to 70 feet. Wow. And it's, this wall reef and it just it's amazing we don't have that here no. that, that doesn't exist here yeah and so um because we ruin everything so yeah so i um I've been how to beautiful and i i've been wanting to just go do something i've been wanting to do a cruise for several years i've only mm-hmm. been on one it was the disney it was in june of 2000 and the daughter was two my son was four and now you know they're 20 six and 27 and three quarters so you yeah. know <laughs> he's getting ready to turn 28 in a few weeks so well now um, you can do an adult cruise <laughs> i am doing a cruise um yeah royal caribbean and i'm super excited i cannot stand myself so yeah I'm, how fun yeah. you're gonna have a great yeah. time yeah it'll yeah. be here before so, you know it so but uh, yeah, tonight's yes. uh, comments. Thank you guys so much for your comments. As usual, um, we appreciate you listening. Uh, if this is your first time listening, please subscribe to us. Uh, every week, we uh, Char will put out a podcast um, of different different events that we're holding. Stop.
We're going to take a pause for a minute. Doggies are barking, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, but yeah, we appreciate you guys very much. Um, Sorry Please, about that. I didn't that's want the dogs okay. to the babies. <laughs> I told them. I, uh, I told them it's okay. We're just taking a little break. Doggies are barking, but it's okay. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, yeah, we appreciate every comment. Um, as you can see, Char is, you know, basically reading almost every comment unless it gets crazy. And then, obviously, she can't read every single comment. But um, we appreciate it. Please subscribe. Please tune in every week. Um, you send one out every Monday, right? Um, well, it's not necessarily Monday. I could post tomorrow. It just varies. It just depends if something pops okay. up the brain yeah. or something triggers something, too, if okay. I haven't decided. so. Okay, yeah. well, so, tune in. Yeah. Tune in to us, please. Um, if you like us to talk about something or you wish uh, for us to talk about something that you would like to hear, please leave it down in the comments and Char will get back to you and I'll turn it over to you. Yes, and as always, you can find us on Spotify, Amazon, Samsung podcast podcast index listen notes apple google pandora tune in iheart deezer we tiktok we're on instagram we're on facebook we're on youtube and we are on patreon there you go we're everywhere tune in tune, tune in, in until and next time yes my dear and i'm going to uh, go check on and see what's going on okay so, sounds um, good have a good night thank you you too Bye. Bye.